Disclaimer, all the character and incident are fiction and everything is imaginary in this episode on compare it with your own life, it's just based on imagination, not on reality. He was sitting beside you but he never paid attention on you. Maybe he does not like you or maybe he get annoyed by you. I am a popular girl of this school, not because of my looks. Actually, I am the daughter of a famous, a rich CEO. People think that I am rich means I am arrogant. But after meeting me, they change their mindset about me, except the person whom I want to impress. The Jeon Jungkook. You looked at him, he was typing something in his phone. You squint your eyes were seeing the name of the person in the chat, but he spoke YN. I am not embarrassed because he caught me staring at his phone. You look away. I am sad because the person he is talking is his one and the only girl best friend whom I hate the most. He looked at your backseat. She smiled at you but I did not show any reaction and looked down at my work. Wyan, at least eat something. I am really worried about you. I am not hungry. Just look at yourself. You was not like that. Wyan, I used to know. I said I am fine. No, don't worry about me. You take off your phone from your pocket and started using it. Wyan, please, come out from this delusion. She rolled her eyes and held your hand. Get up. What? Why? I said get up. You get up and she takes you in your class. You press your lips together after seeing them together. Just look at him. He does not care about your feelings. They laughed. Maybe they are playing a game and yeah, I am jealous because that was my seat. That girl have to be me. That smile have to be for me. But it was opposite. She grabbed your shoulder and turned you to her. Just look at him and look at you. What you did with yourself because of him. Does he care? He did not even talk to you. I know about your intentions. I know how you feel for him. But I feel sorry about you. She hugged you. Please don't waste your life, your beautiful moments for whom who does not even like to talk with you. And somehow she is right. Whole class in, is in the one side and that girl is one side for him. He has a soft side only for her. I have to admit it, he, do, he can't be my. You are right, but this heart is not under my control. You rushed out from there. At night, it's almost midnight but you can't stop yourself thinking about him. Just stop it, Vyan. What are you doing? Just stop thinking about him. He can't be my, so it's better for me to forget him. After all, it was all just one-sided. He never told me to love him. You sit on the last seat and the whole day you just focus on your study. Now, you was walking with your friend. She is not from your class. She is from another class. How are you? I'm good. And you? He held his friend Nina's hand and walk in the front of you. You look down and you did not even look at him. She looked at you then him. I have to do something. I can't see her like that. He walked near you. When can you please help me in this assignment? I'm sorry, I have to go. Nina is here. She must be help you. You bite your lips and get up. What happened to her? You get up and went out. After a week, you enter in the class like always. He was talking with his girl best friend Nina, you take a deep breath then you walk towards your friend's seat. You and Jungkook both sit together because you both are class president but from these six days you did not sit with him. Hey, can I sit here? You come to your friend who was on leave for a week and today he come back. He twisted his eyebrow, he looked back at Jungkook then he looked at you. Yes, of course. You place your bag in the front of you and sit beside him. What happened? Nothing happened. Why you are asking? Today I know you're going to sit with Jungkook. Leave it, hey. I do not want to talk about it. I just want to forget all the scenarios I made in my mind. He slapped on your shoulder. You never listened to me. Didn't I told you to stop behaving introvert at least in the front of him? Become his friend first. But you never listened to me. I do not want to give any hope to myself in this case. So please don't talk about it. Don't lose hope, Vyan. He won't understand that you love him until you tell him about your feelings. As a friend, my suggestion is try at least one more time. Go back to your seat. Take a step first. You blink your eyes and nodded. You walk near your seat and sit beside him. Nina, go back to your seat. Class is going to start. She rushed towards her seat. Jungkook? Hmm? He looked at you. 
You shook your head. N nothing. Tell me if it's important. I blinked my eyes. He was soft towards me. It was the first time in this one year. I tried to control my tears. You unlock your locker when someone pat on your back. You... You turned back. Jungkook, you smiled towards him. He forwarded the water bottle towards you. You saw Mira behind him. She smiled and winked at you. It does not matter how introvert I am, but my friend is a blessing for me. You played very well. Your cheeks turned red. You never expect that he will come to see you, Matt. You both walk together. Can I ask you what happened with you last week? You pressed your lips together. What happened to me? Nothing. You literally ignored me. I literally missed my class president who used to check my phone and my books. You chuckled. Really? I thought you get annoyed by me. Yeah, but somehow it's all make me happy too. Really? Done. From now on. I will check your phone like before. No. Yeah, wait. While running, Nina come in the front of you. You bump into her. Your eyes become wide when you both fell on the floor. You open your eyes in a, in a medical room. What I am doing in the medical room? You turn your face in the right side. You blink your eyes multiple times. Jungkook, you wake up. Tell me how's your feeling now. Is it hurting somewhere? What happened to me? She is fine. Don't worry about her. She already go home. Now get up. I will drop you in your home. But it's just 11 a.m. It's 5 p.m. 5 p.m. Then why did not you go home? How can I left you here? You was my responsibility. You know your mom called me thousands of times. He hold your hand and help you in a walk. Your mother must be worried about you. He twisted his eyebrow when you did not respond to him. When? You looked at him. But where are you? Just wake up. You think, if you do not tell me, then I will never know. What? They didn't tell me already. What he told you? Come on, now I know that you like me. But you like Nina. He look away, he again make you shocked. Nina, she is like my little sister. How can you even think about us like that? Nina, how I start the conversation? She is sitting beside me. You were staring at his phone. Why and you immediately look away. She will look away, Nina. He typed in the message. Flashback of lunchtime. He was in the class with Nina. I really want to see beautiful, beautiful little kids running around you while saying, Mama, why and is still sleeping, Appa? Make our breakfast. Stop it. They both laughed. She looked at the door. Why and where is she? She rushed out. He slapped her shoulder. Why did not you tell me then? Ha, oh, bro, it's not fair. I'm telling you how to impress her and you are getting angry on me. Just wow. After some days. What happened to your face? She is ignoring me. Why did you tell her that you like her? No, sis, I did not know what happened to her. She is not even sitting with me. Oh, I see. She is what? How stupid I am. I literally hate her. I feel jealous from her. Ah, oh. oh my god, why aren't she like my sister? You blink your eyes and you bite your lips. He rolled his eyes. He looked down. He get on the bike and you sit behind him. Hold me tight. You hug him from the back. When I go on a long drive, I already told your mother that today my girlfriend stay at my home. You broke the hug. What? He chuckled and hold you and wrapped it around his waist. I love you too. He start the bike. But I did not even say that I love you. But I said that I love you too. He kissed on the back side of your hand while riding. More I love the story. If something is written in your fed, that thing is just your. No one can see that thing from you. Even if you are introvert, extrovert, that thing is just come to you. In the end, ta-da, bye-bye, take care. See you, love you.